All right, everyone, welcome back to Local 5 News Midday. You know it is not the Iowa State Fair. We don't talk about food at least once on the show. So joining me today, I'm so excited to have them here, is Sammy with the Girl Scouts and Allison with the Midwest Dairy joining us. And they have a very sweet treat uh, to show us today. So Sammy, can you just talk about what this is? Yeah, so this is the Minty Moo Parfait. It is made with vanilla soft serve ice cream. It has some chocolate syrup, and then it has Thin Mint Girl Scout cookie crumbles in it, and it's topped with a whole Thin Mint. And I understand this is probably one of the only times you can get a Thin Mint during the summer. Exactly. It's the only place in Iowa you can get a Thin Mint in the summer, so it's a hot ticket to get. Yeah, yeah. And I know you guys have partnered together. Can you talk about, Allison, just how this partnership works? Yeah, so the Girl Scouts partnered with us starting last year, and they are doing all of our labor in our booths. And then let me tell you, we have the hardest working booths <laughs> at the Iowa State Fair. We actually have two locations, one on Rock Island over by the cattle barn and we have one location in the ag building as well so you have two options and two opportunities to come try some great products and to support the awesome girl scouts we actually have this is the ice cream version we have a frozen yogurt version okay over at the ag building um so you can try two different yeah Nancy Moo parfaits get them both then yeah so we got some options there for you so i know this is one of the new foods uh this year for the fair uh Full disclosure, I tried this before the fair started. I consider it my favorite dessert here uh, this year. Um, what do you guys want people to know just about what this partnership means and what it's like to be able to partner together here at the fair? Yeah, so we are so grateful for this partnership and purchasing the Minty Moo Parfait supports both Girl Scouts of Greater Iowa and the I Iowa dairy community. So we've been calling it a parfait with a purpose. Yeah. And um, it's, it's tasty as well, so that doesn't hurt. <laughs> yeah. We know food is such a good motivation here at the Iowa State Fair, but Allison, you know, the partnership is also educational. It's an opportunity for people to come out and learn. Yeah, absolutely. Actually, they have a great program. If the Girl Scouts come, they can earn a badge or patch. I, I have been working on my terminology for that. Um, so they can come to the booth and get that and take that home with them. But also, we're here to educate about the Iowa dairy community. So people can come to our booth and see our signage and learn more about what Iowa dairy farmers are doing every day to make these tasty, delicious treats. Because I think a lot of people don't understand the hard work that goes in, the 3 a.m. milking, yeah. um, just to make this delicious um, ice cream treat so really we want consumers to learn a little bit while yeah. they're there um, they can check out the milking parlor right next door and they can see um, the whole process yeah. from cow into to ice cream yeah and I know it's been warm so it's been like just the like, perfect weather for ice cream if you guys don't mind I want to like give this a try Absolutely. well not a try I've had it before but <laughs> I've just been eyeing this so let me see here I do kind of want some of this thin mint you know oh my goodness yeah that's good. What, what it, did you help make this? It was a group effort. Um, we kind of brainstormed and played around, but we knew Thin Mint is the number one selling Girl Scout cookie nationwide. So we knew that had to go into ice cream and what goes better than chocolate yeah. mint and ice cream. So Awesome. Well, no thank brainer. you guys so much for coming by and bringing us some treats here. If you guys get a chance, go check them out. Grab one of these tasty desserts. All right.